I'm going to show you how to review video recordings triggered by Hikvision VCA events, also known as smart events, such as line crossing and intrusion detection. Here you can see we're in IBMS 4200, the PC client software, and we're looking at live view from a PTZ. You can see that this PTZ is moving, it's on a patrol. You see it just stopped here and these blue lines and boxes appeared. Those are the regions and lines for the line crossings and intrusion zones. What this, what this PTZ is doing is going through its patrol and at each stop it stays there for a certain number of seconds and enables those smart events in each area and if it detects an object moving in the, in the zone for the set number of uh, seconds or crossing the line, then it starts smart tracking the object. Smart tracking is a feature of the Hike Vision Smart PTZs where they follow and zoom in on moving objects. So once you've recorded such an event, you want to review it. So you need to do this either directly on the NVR or in the software IBMS 4200. And that's what I'm going to show you here. So we'll stop this live view to save our bandwidth and then go over to remote playback. When you go into remote playback, you first need to set your search range. So searching from the fourth to the ninth, from basically midnight to midnight. And then you drag over your camera. It searches for video during that time frame. Okay, now this is basic playback. So it just starts playing back from the beginning of our time search. And you have the list of files here. But we want to see the video that was triggered by the VCA events. So we go to, we click on this button. It says event playback when we hover over it. And it automatically searches for motion detection events, which we actually don't have enabled in this case. So it's not going to find anything. And then you can see here, it automatically um, searches one day based on the day you were just viewing. So I'm actually going to change that to search on the 9th today. And it's doing another search for motion. I'll let that finish or cancel. And we're going to change this to VCA detection. So here are all the recordings triggered by VCA detection. And I have my pre-play time set in IVMS 4200 to five seconds. So I see five seconds before the event occurs and 30 seconds afterward. And it's adjustable in the configuration settings of the software. So you can see I just click on each event and it starts playing that event. So there you have it. That concludes this video on how to review recordings triggered by VCA events.